First, launch the Visual Studio, then create a Windows form. In Form 1, create the design, edit the background image, and add the button. Change the text of the button into click here to order. After that, add another form, which is Form 2. It is where the customer will order. Create the design just like what you did in Form 1. Add the group box 1, 2, and 3. In the group box 1, list all the flavors of the milk tea by adding label. In the group box 2, is the order information and lastly, group box 3 which contains the payment.
In the Form 1, click the button. It is where you will code to show Form 2. Just type Form 2.show. After that, run the program. When you click the button of Form 1, the Form 2 will show up. Next is the Form 2. You will code the Add and Subtract button. It is for the quantity of your order. Run the program and you'll see how it works. The Place Order button will sum up the total purchase and show the receipt of your order. Run the program and see how it works. Next is the clear button, which will clear all the information from the first order. All will get back to zero. Just declare all the text box, label, and value into zero. Next is the receipt button that will connect the information into the database. Connect the server, create a database, any table where you will save the information. In the table, the data type should be similar. In the Visual Basic, declare import and the SQL connection that will connect to the database. After coding the SQL connection, run the program. As you can see, the order you need are recorded into your database, the quantity and the total purchase of it.